the moment, I don't think we're doing so well. Of course, it's a grey old day and uh, it doesn't know what it's doing. It's sort of wanting to burn, but it doesn't. Anyway, there's a setup here. This is my um, my furnace, right? This uh, you've seen it before, but what we've got here, and I get an explanation going, is we've got the uh, air in, which is this. It's a whip, a, a grass blower with a speed controller on it. So we can turn that up or down how we like. So we get the right amount of air pressure in there. But at the moment, I don't think we're doing too well. I can see, I can see light in there, but I don't know how hot it's going to get. Anyway, here's our, our famous oil can again with our needle valve on it. And it goes down, 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 down. And what are we looking at? I can't see bugger all here. Oh, there it is. It comes down here and in the pipe and there's a copper tube going right inside. And it's pouring oil, not pouring, but dripping oil into the furnace. Okay, so that's where we're at at the moment. We're trying to get it to start, but it's not very happy. Okay, come back later. Ding 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 bam 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 Here we have a little squirrely fire going on in there. I took the uh, melting pot out so it could have a little bit more air circulation going through it and it seems to have picked up a little bit. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know if you can see the heat in there, but uh, that baffle pot on the top is getting pretty damn hot. The aluminium inside hasn't melted yet, so we just have to keep going. The heat comes up ever so slowly, but there we go, look at that. There's some heat in that. Hey, don't you think that's wonderful? Here we go, uh, just adding some more aluminium. That's part of a uh, old barbecue, but uh, do note that heat in there. I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but it's glowing yellow hot here. I don't know what the camera shows. Well, might have to turn that radio down. Uh, it's the radio. Turn it down. Okay. This is salt. Salt to put in to the um, aluminium as it's melted. As you can see there, uh, this is the, um, the casting that I just done. Now, I didn't show you me packing the um, lost uh, foam, but I made foam shapes to go in there to actually make the shape that I'm going to pour. Now, I don't know how we're going here. That's, um, ooh, that's sort of stuck, but that's it. Wow, can you imagine? Look at that. This is the shape that we wanted. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Isn't that pretty? Yeah. Yeah, so there we have the actual shape that we want. Now, this is the same shape as that. That's the head from the mower. And that is the same shape. And what I'm going to do is I'll machine this surface here 
so that it's nice and flat and put some yummy holes in it where all of these bolts go. So we put the holes in it where all of the bolts go around and then that will be our new head. And on the top of that, and it's very hot, is a ridge. You might be able to see that. That is going to be the slide that the new valve fits in. And this is just a piece of plate that I'm going to be using. It's aluminium plate. We poured it, we made it, and look how wonderfully clean that is. There's no uh, inclusion or, or bumps or bubbles. And all of this, it all has to be cleaned up. So that's our... Oh, look at that. It's got a dinkle in it. It's got a dinkle there. Oh, no. Well, we might... Oh, look. You can actually see the, the foam shapes in it. That's pretty damn good. But, yeah, that's the aluminium. And that is wonderful. I'm going to make a... Uh, when it's all cleaned up, it'll look beautiful. I'm going to make a valve to fit on the top of that. I'm quite happy with that. That's come up really well. Yep. Not bad at all. That was the peas we had last night. Yep, that tin is now part of the mould. We'll chop it off later. But there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That is what I've done for today. And I'm very impressed with that. That's come up very nicely. Um, the shape's just right. And it looks rough now, but by the time I finish with it, you'll be so surprised that it's the same piece of metal. You'll think, where did that come from? And you'll say to yourself, well, 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 that's amazing. Thank you, Berg. All right, and I was supposed to say a shout-out to Dave in Kiwi Land and Matt in Newcastle and Dud, my little mate in uh, Sydney and then there's that uh, corny fella I don't know what his real name is but it's NW something uh, in Canberra and don't forget doobly doobly alright folks bye bye